Or to the Ford section. Uh, Skyjacker suspension has built the lift kits from 1966 all the way to 2008. We make them for the F100 all the way up to F250 and 350. Starting out in 2004, Ford F-150 come out with a front strut suspension, independent all the way to 08. Two-wheel drive or four-wheel drive, what we've done here is we've made a front leveling kit, which is a metal spacer. What it does is goes above the front strut. All you do is take the three bolts of the front strut down. You do not disassemble it. This goes on top of it. You raise it back up, bolt the strut back into place, and you just lifted it two and a half inches. This is one of the easiest kits to install. Really and truly, it only takes about 45 minutes to install this. We also make for the two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive F-150, we have a two to three inch kit. What this is, is the front strut is a front strut replacement. It comes to the consumer to lift the front end two inches. You take the factory apparatus, in other words, the factory strut, disassemble it with the stock coil spring and top hat, put it on to our new strut, and you will get two inches of lift. If you want more than two inches of lift in the front, say you want three inches of lift, Skyjacker Suspension sends a ring in there to place onto our strut before you assemble which will lift the vehicle three inches in the front. Also for this very vehicle, we make a two-wheel drive, we make a six-inch kit for this vehicle. Four-wheel drive, 2004 to 2008, we make a six-inch for this also. We make a non-skip plate kit and a skip plate kit. Non-skip plate, of course, being for those people that do not care about going off-roading that much and just want the lift for a larger tire. Then we make the skip plate kit for those people that do off-road regularly. 97 to 03 and the 04 Heritage, which is the rounder body style, six inch suspension for a four wheel drive. This is the torsion bar front suspension before they went to strut. We have a six inch for it. We also have a non-skid plate and a skid plate kit for this vehicle also. This is one of the easiest kits to install in the industry today because you only drill two holes. 80 to 96 F-150 Bronco. What we've done here is this is the when uh, Ford come out with the scissor type front end. We offer two different styles. We also offer two, two eight inches of lift, but the two, two, two different styles are a class one and class two. Class one being just a bracket kit. What that is is a bracket kit for every, every part of the vehicle that you lift. In other words, the differential and also the front radius arm. You relocate with a class one. Class two is a radius arm replacement. That is a 15 inch longer tubulous radius arm that can also be bought separately. 66 to 79, F100, F150, and the Bronco. This is where Lonnie McCurry Sr., the owner of Skyjacker, first started developing kits for. We offer from two all the way to nine inches for this vehicle. Two to two and a half inch front leveling kit. This is for the 2008 F-250. 05, they come out with a coil spring front end for the 250 and 350. Ford went back to the coil spring of earlier years. We offer leveling kits for the coil spring as for the front, gas or diesel, and we also offer a poly spacer for the front, one inch or two inch. We offer for this year a four or six inch kit. What we do for this, Skyjack are different from any of the other manufacturers, is we include stainless steel brake lines and steering stabilizer. The reason we do that, the stainless steel brake line is replaced on the vehicle because what we've done or what we've decided at Skyjacker is that when you lift this vehicle above four inches, it swells the front brake line, the factory line. So Skyjacker determined that what we need to do is we need to replace that front brake line with a stainless steel braided line that's tested up to 1500 PSI. Also has a poly coating on the outside. Every one of our kits from four inches all the way up to eight and a half comes with this brake line. 8.5 inch kit for the F-250 and F-350, gas or diesel. What we've done here different than the other manufacturers is the factory radius arm is a pinch welded or two pieces of metal put together to make the actual radius arm on the front of this vehicle. What we've done when we decided when you go above six inches, that actual radius arm does flex. So we know when you go above six inches, you need to replace that. So what we've done here at Skyjacker is we've developed a four bar or a upper and lower control arm. We send this in our eight and a half inch kit that can also be bought separately for other manufacturers as long as they have a radius arm drop bracket. What this arm has, it has a new generation heim at one end for adjustability. We've taken the internal workings out of this new generation heim and placed a vulcanized press-in bushing for strength. 
05 to 07 is basically the same coverage as we were talking about for the 08. Everything is almost exactly the same except for some of the bracketry on these years. So we offer one inch all the way to eight and a half. Options for these years, 05 to 07, we also have a front skid plate for the differential. This fits from two inches of lift all the way to about 10. What we've done here is this only fits in 05 to 07 because in 08 they changed the front crash bar. Dual steering stabilizer, we offer these from 05 all the way to 08 for the F250 and 350. What we've done here, we've also built a front sway bar for the 05 to 07. This is different than the 08 because that's one of the things Ford did change. It's a thicker and larger material for the front sway bar. 99 to 04, F250 and 350. This is the leaf spring vehicle of older years. What we've done on this vehicle is we offer a six or eight inch kit, which is a coil over conversions. What this is, is you take the stock leaf spring, take it off and put a coil over on the front of it. This is a totally bolt on vehicle. For this same year, 99 to 04, the leaf spring vehicle, we offer two inches all the way to eight inches of lift. Options for this year, 99 to 04, we have a triple shock kit for the front of this vehicle. What we've done is we've taken the stock location shock, put bracketry upper and lower, and added two shocks to either side. What we like to say in this apparatus here is that always try to recommend a hydraulic shock. Also for this year, we offer a care bearing drop kit. The reason we offer a care bearing drop kit as an option for 99 to 04, because in 05, almost all of the vehicles F250s had a care bearing from the factory. It was an option in 99 to 04, but Skyjacker has approached it and we have a one to two and a quarter inch drop. We also have adjustable front track bar with cervical hymns at either end. And also dual steering stabilizers. 67 to 98, F250 and F350. This coverage here, we cover all the way from the low boy, high boy, all the way up to the straight axle conversion and the scissor type front end on the F250. We offer from two inches all the way up to eight inches of lift. 83 to 96, Mazda, Ford, Ranger. What we've done here is we offer a two all the way to eight inches of lift. This is the same thing we were talking about for the F-150. We offer a class one and class two system and kit, which of course the class one being a bracket and then the class two being a radius arm conversion.